AV-685 Removal The AV-685 employs a keyless shaft mount to lock the AV-685's rotor to a 1.125 inch diameter shaft. An anti-rotation arm prevents housing rotation while allowing for shaft end float. The AV-685 can be installed either as end of shaft model or as through shaft model. This video demonstrates end of shaft removal. Unfasten the AV-685 threaded arm tether point. Remove the AV-685 end cap screws and the AV-685 end cap. Remove the end cap, o-ring, and wave spring, noting the location of each to assist in reassembly. Note that the o-ring is typically retained by the groove in the end cap. Using the two AV-685 installation wrenches, grip the clater nut and the compression sleeve. Loosen only the compression sleeve, the smaller nut, using the Avtron wrench. Do not use non-Avtron or oversized wrenches to loosen the sleeve. The clater nut wrench is held stationary. Do not turn the clater nut. Slide the AV-685 off the shaft. Do not pry the AV-685 or pound it off the shaft. If the AV-685 cannot be moved by hand, use a gear puller to remove the AV-685. Inspect for bearing damage as gear pullers can damage the AV-685 bearing system. This concludes AV-685 removal.